Hello, hi, and marhaba, welcome back to Baby Blue Gaming Channel. Today, episode is all about The Sims 4. As you saw in the thumbnail and the title, we are gonna talk about a main problem and a major problem in the community of Sims 4 that most of us have uh, for the lots and houses that are actually not showing in the library folder. And I did a lot of researches about this topic and I did my homework asking people searching for the answer and I, unfortunately most answers where you have to check the include custom content or on the options where you have to check also for the custom content and as well but actually it never worked with me it was a mysterious and frustrating frustrating problem for me because all of us like love having lots though the mods worked far fine for me i mean i d did all the steps that you have to separate the folders add the fo uh, mod folders or all the dot packages into the packages folder and adding the tray folders in the tray folders and nothing worked as well so i kept like researching till i finally found the solution for all this and i was surprised how easy it was you're gonna be surprised as well guys and i really hope it worked out for you as well i'm gonna show you a life proof from the game we're gonna test one file and i when i actually found out about this i wanted to record it immediately i didn't believe my eyes like i'm gonna show you guys a proof and you're gonna see it together actually when i start the game and test it with you guys and we, I'm going to show you how many lots as well. I'm going to download and actually launch it in the game. So please guys leave a like and comment and subscribe to join the family. And hoping you stay permanent and we see the upcoming videos for me. So let's go and see the method. So as you can see guys, this is the Sims 4 updates. This is one of my favorite Sims 4 websites that it all combine all the Sims 4 website or links in one place. You can find literally everything and it's all categorized in fields like you can find accessories, Sims, lots, whatever you're looking for, just type it in the search engine as well. You can find it there and surprisingly there is like links to the sources like if you find a specific lot it would take you to their source itself and you can read more about it you can read description you can even re read from the developer if it need a specific installation so you don't have to worry about any lot or something that you are downloading what i'm looking for here is for a sushi restaurant um, I was frustrated before I couldn't download it because I have no idea how to do it But since I discovered this new method, which is by the way, this is the first time me trying this method with you guys So let's cross our fingers hoping it would work So now I'm going to download the sushi restaurant as you can see um, This is the one that I'm looking for. I was like so in love with the design and as it, as it said it has no cc's like it has an amazing um decorative things oh look at this flower shop uh, actually there's a lot of lots i'm very confused what to download but i'm still going to focus on the sushi restaurant let's stay focused on our main topic we need to download this sushi restaurant guys immediately so it takes it takes me to the sims resource as you can see and i have to download it continue to downloading the thing about the sims resource is that you have to wait 15 seconds till you'll be able to download each file you can't duplicate or you can't download two files at the same time now we're going to have the pop-up link um and I usually actually put them in a specific folder, like let's say Sims folder. But for this video, I'm going to put it on the desktop. So we'll make things easier. The Now the method is you have to extract the file that you download in the tray folder. Do not extract it on desktop or anywhere else. Go to the electronic arts, Sims 4, go to the tray folder 
paste it there and then extract it to extract it to a separate folder or with a, a sushi restaurant folder don't extract it randomly because some files has mods some files has other cc's that you need to separate it from the tray folder now since we extract it you have to take what's inside this folder and put it on um, the tray folder the mechanism of sims4 that you it actually doesn't read subfolders you can't put inside the tray folder another folder sometimes it doesn't read it so that's the solution it's as simple as that take what's inside the folder that you have and put it on the tray folder don't leave any subfolders like you can see i will delete this sushi restaurant don't put anything uh, i'm gonna test it now to see this theory you saw i have a lot of tray folders and a lot of uh, lots none of them actually work but we're gonna test the um, theory on this sushi restaurant to be specific because god knows if it's actually gonna work so now we have the sims i'm gonna open my library now and let's test it together and keep in mind that you have to keep the custom content can we find the sushi restaurant mm. where is it Oh, please God, let it happen, let it happen. Hmm. Where is the sushi restaurant? Oh my God. Here is the sushi restaurant, guys. It actually worked. Oh my God. I'm very happy. I'm very pleased that this method works. Please, guys, leave a comment and like if this method worked with you. And please give a subscribe for my effort. Oh, you have no idea how much I tried to solve this Damn, this is very, very, very heartwarming ah. So now as you can see guys I uh, actually downloaded the whole, you know, files that I need And I never had in my sims And actually I'm gonna show you in the game the amount of flots that I did download and adjusted in the game I'm really happy okay so as you can see guys now and I'm in new crest and look how much I have downloaded uh, for my sims uh, lots like I have here a cafe and downtown street and actually I tested all of them and all of them works fine um, and I'm really amazed like I downloaded even malls big malls small malls you can see here I it's all working and I can see I show you even here in my library um, keep in mind that you have to check the uh, include custom content you know the typical things that you have to do for CC because most videos that I have saw always keep mentioning that this is the solution for just check on the advanced include the custom content and in the option as well but this is not the solution you have to check them yes but this is not the actual solution in my point of view so uh, I mean in my own situation I guess so I always check this on cloud custom content and of course in the options you have to also uh, check for the uh, you know enabling the CC's and custom content as well so as you can see here um, you can see the lots that I have downloaded and as I told you all working fine all of them literally working and I can download them uh, I did upload them to the game and I tested them and it's working just amazingly I'm gonna give you another example Okay, so as you can see, this is the um, place that I have downloaded. It's actually um, set together and we're gonna make them order a table. Okay, so as you can see, guys, uh, I'm gonna pause. And this place is very beautiful. Um, where is my mouse? My beautiful mouse. I don't know how to work. 
Okay, so this is the lot that I was telling you about. Uh, it's basically a restaurant that's meant to be on a like water and uh, when I downloaded this lot the only problem was the water is missing you have to apply it yourself so I added the water and decorated it myself and it works fine like look at this atmosphere it's so romantic and you can take amazing photos for your dating sims I guess like now I did um, and uh, the only thing I don't like about uh, Sims 4 is the lighting like I mean see you can't see the lighting very well but I have discovered that you can actually type in control shift and C and uh, type show hidden objects I think uh, cheat so when you click on show hidden objects actually you can find items that are not showing in the shopping so I can find this item that you can actually add lights without seeing them like it's like a game light um, so I'm gonna show you guys this place in the morning see so this is the place I added the water and I already have these boats and th those lightings were already there in the lot so I just added this fountain I thought it would be romantic as well and this is that uh, I also downloaded this uh, I think grocery shop or something like that and downloaded this um, I think it was like an arcade or as I told you the bottom line I did download a lot I'm just gonna finally show you the light that I was talking about when you download any lot and find the lighting is not just there for you just go to the lightings uh, not electronics lighting okay so you can find them in the mask folder um, I really like this I really like those lights they help a lot like if you can if you want to also make them bigger you can click shift and I don't know this shape I'm gonna put the shape for you on the screen and you can add the light so I'm gonna just put the light here and see uh, the place look way better with all the lightings see it's not like something wrong it just lights <laughs> so yeah this is my I'm gonna save so guys uh, I hope you like this video and I hope I helped with the Sims 4 problem for the lots that are not showing in the library. Please leave a comment, a like and subscribe so we so you can be part of the blue family. So as always guys stay awesome, stay tuned for the next videos. Bye bye!